we can write a loop inside another loop. Consider this example. The outer loop in line 3 will execute as long as a is less than 3. The inner loop at line 5 will execute as long as b is less than 2. Let's walk through this program. In lines 1 and 2, Python assigns 0 to variables a and c. Since a is 0, this test is true, and Python enters the loop body at line 4. In line 4, Python stores 0 in variable b. In line 5, Python sees the inner while statement with the test b is less than 2. Since b is 0, this test is true, and Python is going to enter the inner loop body. In line 6, Python adds 1 to variable c. In line 7, Python adds 1 to variable b. The current line is now 8 and the current tab is 2. Since the statement in line 8 is in tab 1, Python has reached the end of the inner loop body. Python now checks the control map entry at current tab minus 1, which is 1. The control map contains two entries, one for each while statement. The value at tab 1 is while 5. This entry indicates that Python is currently inside a loop, so Python jumps back to line 5 and tab 1. Python now executes the while test b is less than 2. Since b is 1, the test is still true, and Python enters the inner loop body again. Inside the inner loop, Python again increases both c and b by 1. Python reaches the end of the inner loop body again and jumps back to line 5, tab 1. b is now 2, so the while test b is less than 2 is false. Thus, this time, Python skips the inner loop body. Note that Python executed the inner loop body two times. Python now executes the statement at line 8 and tab 1. Python adds 1 to variable a. Current line is now 9 and the current tab is 1. Python has reached the end of the program. Since current tab is not 0, Python checks the control map entry at the current tab minus 1. The current tab is 1, so we want the entry at tab 0, which is while 3. Thus, Python jumps back to line 3. At this point, a is 1, b is 2, and c is 2. a is still less than 3, so Python enters the outer loop body again. In line 4, b is reset to 0. Thus, b is again less than 2, and Python will execute the inner loop body twice as before. Then in line 8, Python increases a by 1 and jumps back to line 3, tab 0. 
At this point, a is two and c is four. A is still less than three, so Python executes the outer loop body again. Once again, Python executes the inner loop body twice, increases a by one, and jumps back to line three, tab zero. At time 193, a is 3 and c is 6. The outer while test is now false, and Python is going to skip the outer loop body. Python has reached the end of the program. Since current tab is 0, Python goes ahead and exits the program. Python executed the outer loop body three times. In each iteration, Python executed the inner loop body twice. Therefore, Python executed the inner loop body a total of six times. 